Hey there! Welcome to my channel. My name is Jay. Today I am here with you to kickstart off a new series based on Kafka, Elasticsearch and GraphQL. What we will be learning from this series. In this series, we are going to mainly create two tiny microservices, that is a catalog service and order service, where we will understand the concept of the Kafka communications between these two services. And we will learn how Elasticsearch is working for our e-commerce projects. And we will use Prisma as an ORM to fulfill our data access layer. We will create another client API service to talk with our microservices to reduce the complexity of the multiple service endpoints and authentication. In the bot D microservices, we are going to follow the clean architecture design pattern. So we will write the test cases as well as. Another big topic we will learn before jumping into the coding, uh, that is how Azal process is working. If we need to build this whole process, then how much time we can estimate? It's really important to familiar with the Azal process to gain understanding of how big system and big companies are working. If you have a plan to grab good opportunity, then certainly this is another layer you need to fix of your career Ruby cube. This is the roadmap of our complete series. You can follow along with me uh, step by step, or if you are familiar with the certain steps, then you can skip it and move forward to the next one. It is, but it is highly recommended to follow along with me. If you are new to my channel and if you are not familiar with microservice architecture, then I would like to highly recommend you go ahead and watch this specific playlist from my channel where I have explained how microservice is working from the scratch, how we can break down the uh, monolithic architecture to microservice architecture. Right? And if you are looking for some advanced courses, if you are looking for advanced concept of the Node.js microservice, then I would like to recommend you go ahead and watch this a Node.js microservice masterclass series, which is we have built our Node.js microservice using serverless. Right. Perfect. Then let's take a break here and we are going to continue from the next episode.